to fix FaceTime icon grayed out for contact on iPhone. Verify contacts device compatibility. Ensure the contact uses an Apple device, iPhone, iPad, or Mac that supports FaceTime. FaceTime is exclusive to Apple devices. Attempting to call non-Apple devices will result in the icon being grayed out. Confirm contact information. Open the contacts app. Select the problematic contact. Ensure their phone number or email address is correctly entered and associated with their Apple ID. Incorrect or outdated information can prevent FaceTime from recognizing the contact. If they both are correct still, you can't make FaceTime calls. Proceed to the next step. Check FaceTime settings. This can refresh the connection and resolve minor glitches. Go to the settings, then scroll down to the bottom, click on Apps, then search for FaceTime, tap on it. Ensure FaceTime is toggled on. If it's already on, toggle it off, wait a moment, and turn it back on. Go back and check if your issue is resolved or not. Still, it is not fixed. Then, proceed to the next step. Review screen time restrictions. Restrictions can inadvertently disable FaceTime, causing the icon to gray out. Go to Settings. Then, select Screen Time. Tap on Content and Privacy Restrictions. Select Allowed Apps. Ensure FaceTime is enabled. Go back and check the contact to know if the issue is resolved or not. Still, I didn't resolve to go to the next step. Reset Network Settings. It can resolve network-related issues affecting FaceTime. Open Settings app on your phone. Scroll down and select General. Then scroll down, click on Transfer or Reset iPhone. Next, tap on Reset and then select Reset Network Settings. Enter your passcode if prompted. This action will reset Wi-Fi networks and passwords, cellular settings, and VPN APN settings. This can fix your issue. Still, it didn't fix it. Proceed to next step, update iOS. This keeps your iPhone updated, ensures compatibility, and can fix known bugs. Navigate to settings. Scroll down and click on the general. Next, click on the software update. If an update is available, tap download and install. Now, go to that gray out contact and check if it's normal or not. Still, I didn't resolve it and proceeded to the next step. Recreate the contact. This can resolve issues stemming from corrupted contact data. In the Contacts app, locate and delete the problematic contact. Re-add the contact with the correct information. Almost, this can resolve your issue. If it doesn't, then proceed to final step. Contact Apple Support. If the issue persists after trying these steps, consider reaching out to Apple Support for further assistance. And that's it.